Hi, it's Tina Bennett again with another legal tip, not legal advice. It's just plain old legal information. And today I'm in Barnes and Nobles giving you a mini presentation about what parents can expect when they have a child and have to go through the child support collection unit of the wonderful state of New York. So what I need to tell everybody is one of the things that happens if you have to make payments to New York State that go directly to the mother or father of your child, depending on what sex you are, this is what happens with your money. Your money goes to Albany. Once it goes to Albany, it gets held depending upon the amount of money that you send. So if you send $50 a week because that's what your child support order says, you will then send $50 to Albany. That money gets held, but where does the interest go? That is the very good question that I always ask support magistrates. So where does that interest go? I found out it goes to the general fund. And what is the general fund? It is Governor Cuomo, our current governor's personal slush fund. So instead of interest payments going to parents, the interest payments goes go to New York State, even though New York State re receives money for collecting child support, which was set up through the federal government. So remember, every time a payment is made to New York State, a parent doesn't get 100% of that money. The interest payments go to the general fund. So I think it's sort of like a double dip. But what can I say? I'm just a lawyer having a side practice doing something else. So one of the things you don't wanna do if you have to have your payments go through support collection unit is get three payments behind because you are not the parent of this little boy, Ryan, a billionaire, okay, who has lots of money on his own and his parents don't have to do anything. But what you'll do is lose your passport, which means taking Ryan on a road trip, you will not have a day at the airport. You hear me? no passport, you lose your driver's license, they will raid your bank account. And guess what? That little crappy car you drive, they will take that too <laughs> and sell it for 50 bucks to pay your child support arrears. So if you want child support to change, what you need to do is write your governor, write the senator, write your local politician, do something. Don't sit on your butts or your hands or whatever else you sit on. Make it happen for change. So I'm Tina Bennett again with another little legal nugget, tidbit, whatever. Have a good day. From Barnes and Nobles, let's give them a shout out.